feel like with me, a lot of people never really get to see behind the scenes and like how I do what I do, you know. He gave kids throughout Pittsburgh a, a real role model and a true, genuine person that they can look up to and, and want to emulate. His positivity and his energy is contagious. He's been the blueprint of how to give back. I'm going to be playing football. I can't coach. But I'm going to come to y'all games when I can, though. It seemed to me DeMar had coinciding goals. He was going to play in the National Football League, and he was going to use that platform to give back to the people that helped him get there to his community. What team do you play for? The, the Eagles. All right, we're going to figure it out, bro. We're going to figure it out. Just across the river from his close-knit community of McKees Rocks, Pennsylvania, DeMar Hamlin starred at Central Catholic High School in Pittsburgh, where he set the example on and off the field. We had lost a game his senior year that we shouldn't have lost, and everyone was dejected. And I was on my way in here for a nine o'clock practice, and I pull up about quarter to nine, and DeMar has them on the field already practicing. We went the rest of the way without a loss, 15 and one state champions. He was hurt his senior year, and he served as a water boy at that time. So it was really cool to see the star player, you know, He's so down to earth and, you know, willing to help his teammates in a way that's, you know, not exactly on the field during a play. That's a photo that says what this guy's about. You know, this is a kid with 48 major college football offers is willing to provide a service to his teammates when he can't go. A highly touted recruit entering college, there was one factor he says meant more to him than anything. It was tough to choose and just playing for the hometown team and doing something special here, that's what really separated it. He had a real younger brother. Now he just wanted to be home and just be able to just be in his life, just be that role model for him. He always brought his little brother Mir to practice and you know it was just such a family atmosphere and we all became you know like family to his little brother too. Great job by DeMar Hamlin. And it's Hamlin who's come up with the pick. We don't got no reason to not come out here and work every day. He's everything you'd want, you know, in a teammate. You know, there's not a time where I could say he wasn't there when anyone needed him. In December of 2020, as his collegiate career at Pitt came to a close, Hamlin drew from his experience working at his mom's child care center to give back. Today, um, we got the toy drive going on just to have an event where kids can come out, get a toy. I'm thankful that I can even be in this position to get back. This is stuff I always thought of, but to be doing it, it's just like a, you know, it's a different feeling that I can't really describe right now. In 2021, Hamlin was drafted by the Buffalo Bills in the sixth round. You deserve it. Back in 2020, Hamlin established a GoFundMe to benefit a toy drive in McKee's Rocks. The goal was $2,500. As you can see, his community toy drive has now raised 3 million, 4.75 million. That number keeps rising, incredible to see. In the week since that Monday night game, it has gone into the millions. It shows how many people that he touched throughout his career and his life, not just the NFL community, but I think around the world, you saw an unbelievable showing of support for him. It shows you exactly the type of person he is and like the type of heart he has.